guys, welcome to a Wild Rumble prediction video. It's been a while since I've done one of these. We are live on Twitch, and obviously you guys are going to see this when it's edited and done out for, obviously, YouTube. This is my Wild Rumble predictions for 2021. Um, obviously, I believe this was the last PFU last year when they allowed audience before the whole COVID situation. So, anyway, I'm going to tell you guys how it's going to work. So pretty much I'm going to predict who's going to win each match and see how far I'm right or wrong. Um, for women, I could pick three divas, or three women, as it's known. Why did I say divas for? Or three men who I think could win. Out of the three. So anyway, I think I've done everything right. We should be able to start show now. Let's start it. Let's get into it. Let's make some WWE predictions for the Wild Rumble match. Let's go. Let's do this. It's going to take a while to just load in, but that's fine. Because WWE 2K20 is so slow. There's other fireworks. The, the audience are pumped. Let's go, guys. I am actually really excited to see who the dirty games think is going to win this Royal Rumble each match. Obviously, we'll see how right I am and see how different I am to the WWE games. Um, obviously, we're just going to wait for a I should have really done it when that came in, to be all fair. It would have been better, but whatever. It is what it is. We can't really do anything. So, I'm going to show you the matches first and um, the way I've booked it, how I think WWE will book it, and then I'll explain why. So, I've started off with the 30 women Royal Rumble. Um, Sasha Banks versus Carmella for obviously the SmackDown Women's Championship. We've got the tag team titles on the line. Um, obviously the Universal title, isn't that? No, the, okay, sorry, Dirty Day title. Sorry, I'll get it right. Um, Drew McIntyre versus Goldberg. Obviously, Universal title, which is Kevin Owens versus Roman Reigns, the last man standing. And then obviously, we've got the 30 man Royal Rumble. So. Like I said, I'm going to simulate um, each match. I'm not going to play any match. Um, you guys aren't going to see any gameplay in this whatsoever. I'm just literally going to tell you who I think is going to win. Um, Storm of the Women's Royal Rumble. Obviously, I can pick three. Um, my first choice will probably be when she... Obviously, she's already booked in a match later on, which is Charlotte Flit. I think... Obviously, Charlotte's just came back from injury. I think they might push her to win. Obviously, then they go defend the women's tag team. She then turns on Oscar. Obviously, setting up the huge match for WrestleMania, which could work. Um, my second pick would probably be Ronda Rousey. Now, it has been rumoured for quite a long time and quite a bit that she could come back and um, obviously, you know, win it. And obviously, that'd be a good match for her. Obviously, we seen her a couple of years ago who made her first debut in Royal Rumble. And I always said it would have been meant if she was in the Royal Rumble. And she's never done it, so why not? My next match, um, this, like I just said, with the Women's Royal Rumble, I think I'm going to have to go with a new Women's Tag Team Champions, which is Cena Brails and, and Nia Jax. I think that would be a good match. Um, it won't be a good match. It'll be an alright match, I think. Next match, we're going to go on to Drew McIntyre versus Goldberg. Drew McIntyre. Like, I'm not even going to go into detail why. Um, but yeah. Um, obviously, we've got Last Man's Time match, which is obviously the champion Roman Reigns versus Kevin Owens. Roman Reigns, I don't, I don't see WWE pushing Kevin Owens as far as to put the title on him. So that's why. And then, last but not least, the men's world number, which again I can pick three. Um, th and this is probably the hardest one because I think I'm thinking of like a few who could win it, but obviously Duddy hasn't really pushed anyone to win. I I can kind of see how WrestleMania is going to look um, in a couple of months' time. Like Randy's going to verse um, the Fiend. Um, I think oh he's gonna verse Triple H um, and the Triple H will be like a new theme or whatever. Um oh, oh. I forgot her name as well. Sorry, I was I just thought of another diva who could win the World Rumble. I know take off that last pick. But it's too late now. Um but okay. 
follow my men. If I if I think really quick, who I want to win this match. My first one will probably be, and this is a big, probably a big one for most people. But there's been t one that's rumored to win, and he could win it. John Cena. No one wants Cena to win, but he could win it. My second pick, and these are good. The next two picks on in WWE at the minute, but I'm gonna go with The Rock. The reason why I'm going to see The Rock for, I don't think he needs to win the Royal Rumble. Let's face it, he doesn't. But I do think they're going to book Roman Reigns versus The Rock at WrestleMania. And I think to build up to it, The Rock will want to prove that he's still worthy of being the man at the dinner, as they keep seeing, or the king at the table, whatever they keep seeing. So I think The Rock could possibly make his return, win it, obviously versus Roman Reigns for the title at the WrestleMania. My next and final pick, and it's a guy I'm hoping he does come back. I, he keeps trolling us like this, but I'm going to have to go CM Punk. It, it makes sense. Make CM Punk come back. Make him win the Royal Rumble match. Make him have his main event against Drew or Roman for the title. And give him his moment. Let him win. He, he said he wasn't bothered about winning, but I, I could see it like Drew McIntyre versus CM Punk. I can see that being a great match. Both of them dressed up as pirates. Both of them coming out to the ring. It'd be epic, absolute epic. You know, like, but th yeah, that's my choices anyway, guys. Um, I'm gonna go back to the women's one. I'm gonna move my last pick, and let's see who do do thinks is gonna win. We're gonna skip. Who did the pick? I called it. I literally said Charlotte Flair is going to win. Obviously, she's going to turn this match. Don't they think the same as me? They're thinking, all oh, right, okay. Obviously, I just think Sasha Banks is going to win this. I don't think we're going to get a new champion. Yeah. Women's title, maybe she'll. New. Yeah. You kidding me, game? Like, out of the three ones who I think is going to win, the game thinks it's going to. I, I said Drew McIntyre. Drew McIntyre wins, Roman Reigns, Roman Reigns wins. Now, I don't think I was going to pick the last match as mine. I don't think I put the same program in. Seth freaking Rollins. So there you go, guys. So, pretty much every prediction I have made, the game is seeing this. So, I obviously said Charlotte, maybe for the Royal Rumble. Um, obviously, such Bucks retains, um, new women's champions, uh, main champions retain. And then obviously I pick CM Punk, The Rock, or John Cena. They're picking Seth freaking Rollins to win it, guys. And to be all fair, he could. He could actually win it. I could I could see him, you know, versus Drew McIntyre in a pirate, pirate match. Um, but let me know what you think, guys. Let me know in the comments who you think is going to win, guys. I would really be interested to read it. Um, I'm sorry that I don't know everyone's names. I really do. But... I am much study in ages. I just thought it'd be nice to bring my predictions back and um, give you guys my feedback on who's gonna win and stuff like that. So if you wanna drop any comments down and let me know guys, I'd be much appreciated. Okay guys, it was just quick um on my predictions. Uh, the woman was Alexa Bliss.